Last week, Washington State University College Republicans and Young Democrats held their first debate of the school year on campus. Five topics were debated, including health care, renewable energy, tax reform, the opioid crisis, and gun control. Before I was president, there uh, were uh, no d uh, debates at all besides one exception in 2012. But since then, we've done at least one debate every semester. And uh, as long as I'm around, I'm going to make sure that's continued. Tonight, the Young Democrats and College Republicans of WSU gathered here in the Cub Junior Ballroom to debate several controversial issues in their first debate of the semester. Of all the topics debated, Pilo, along with College Republicans President Amir Resmond, agreed gun control was the most controversial. Speaking for the Young Democrats, Mohammed Salem said the Second Amendment should be rewarded and the types of guns that citizens can own should become more limited to prevent future incidents. Stuart Walsh of the College Republicans argued that background checks continue to ensure citizen safety and that national concealed carry permits or student campus carry permits are more effective ways to combat mass shootings. Gun control and immigration is certainly a topic that gets people fiery. Um, it gets them you know, very, very uh, up in arms on whatever side they're on. Um, and, and generally they, you know, end up being the most contentious as a result. Members of both groups agree that debates like this one are important to attend or be a part of because they help generate meaningful conversations about topics that affect everyone in this community. No official plans are made, but both groups hope to debate again next semester. Jasmine Duracci, Murrow News 8.